Some people in this world need to take a chill pill. These are just a couple of the people that are on the internet who are just mad. They are just, they are just bad to the bone. Look at this dude, he looks militant. He looks militant. You, you just wouldn't want to like meet him in a dark alleyway, would you? I mean, Mr. Bizal Dudu Zuppity Bop Bop Bop. The fuck is that name? I think his parents are having a bit of a laugh when they named him. Fucking hell. David Darris. <laughs> I can't even say his name. David Davis, the man with half a haircut. This dude basically got into a fight with his barber and got arrested with half a haircut. He literally looks like Mia Khalifa. <laughs> Could you imagine his prison name? Oi, half cut. Half cut. Not everybody that commits murder or like assaults someone is a man. Uh, and this woman proves it. This this crazy, crazy fucking woman who stabs her husband with a fucking squirrel. Jesus Christ. She stabbed her husband with his squirrel. Oh, this man. Look at him. He's scary. Scary. I wonder what um, Gaylord Willems... Gaylord Willems got arrested for. Whoever can find that out, please comment below. See, that this is quite a normal picture for a mugshot, and you're probably wondering, why is, why is Michael showing you this? She's got a fucking vagina on her neck, mate. She has a vagina on her neck. I've heard of a dickhead, but I've never heard of a vagina neck. Hashtag vagina neck. Get that trending on Twitter. This, this dude is the baddest. The baddest of them all. Jody Enk, right, got arrested for an overdue library book. Mind blown! Mind blown! How can somebody be that much of a badass? An overdue library book. Jesus Christ. Mate, we need to get him the death penalty. Overdue library book. We've got have people doing that. Fifty Shades of not giving it back. Jose Diaz Marin, bro. I guess I have to say that in a Mexican accent. Jose Diaz Marin, bro. That, that was my attempt of a Mexican accent. I'm very sorry if I offended anyone. So this dude is just a bit of a retard, let's be honest. He breaks into someone's house, he sees a pot on the side called Charlie. And if you don't know, Charlie is a slang word for cocaine. So what he does is he steals, he steals the pot and snorts what's inside. The stuff inside were the ashes of a dead fucking dog. He snorted a dog. If you're ever going to commit a crime, guys, use their fucking disguise. Dumb American criminals attempt robbery with permanent marker pen disguises. Look at them. Look at them. They are militant. Charles Ross, according to everybody in the school, was the scariest person in the school. Nobody went near him. He was scary because he got arrested for giving wedgies. Whoa! Don't you ever pull their underwear. Don't you do it. I hope he gets 25 to life like he deserves, maybe without parole.